Jesus burdens. Jesus is great because he knows our problems. He knows our burdens. He knows our struggles. He knows our battles. And everybody has them. Everybody has burdens and battles. How does Jesus deal with us? Matthew 7, one of the things that he tells us is there are some things that we have that he just removes. He takes them away from us. Things that are hindering, things that are hurting, things that are bothering. He said, ask, you'll receive. Seek, you'll find. Knock, it'll be open to you. How long has it been since I've asked Jesus about a burden that I'm dealing with? Because he's made a promise. He's promised that he will take care of us. But you might be thinking, well, sometimes I've asked Jesus about burdens and he didn't take it away. He didn't always do that. 2 Corinthians chapter 12 and verse 9, Paul had a burden. He called it a thorn in the flesh and he had prayed hard three times to get it removed. And his answer was this, not I'm going to take it away from you, but the Lord said, my grace is sufficient for you. Sometimes our burdens turn into blessings. Sometimes learning to deal with burdens, learning to deal with problems, knowing that he gives us grace to deal with them, helps us to trust in God more, helps us to relate to other people more, helps us to help people when they have their burdens. And that's kind of the third thing that I want to mention. He gives us strength to help other people with their problems. In Galatians chapter six and verse two, we're told, bear one another's burdens. I'm not the only one that has burdens. Everybody has them. And so I don't need to become so focused on my own challenges that I forget to look around and see. Jesus gives me strength to help other people. I wanna do that today. I wanna to look around and see other people and see what I can do to help. There's a song and part of the words are these. Sometimes he calms the storm and sometimes he calms me. Sometimes Jesus takes my burdens away and sometimes he gives me the grace and strength to deal with them and he always wants me to be looking to help other people. First Peter chapter 5 verses 6 and 7 tell me and you to humble ourselves in the sight of the Lord, to humble ourselves before him and to cast our burdens, our anxieties, our cares on him and it makes his promise because he cares for us. Jesus cares for me, he cares for you. He'll remove some of my burdens, he'll help me deal with other burdens, and he'll give me strength to help other people.